Yeah, there we go. Yeah, right. this is gonna work. <laughs> <laughs> then we get sued by Lord of the Rings people. Well, it's just like three seconds left. Yet. Yep, it's just. <laughs> 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 okay, the longer I look at it, the more I laugh. <laughs> <laughs> I am so glad I'm recording this right now. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome to Adventures in Soron, where we are trying to finish off the cultists of this damned dwellings of the dank caves. And right now, it's Mutaki's turn. Oh, shh. Shoot, son. Okay. Um. You are faced off with a possessed child from the orphanage. I am indeed, yes. And I don't see myself. You are right up here. Right up here. Oh, 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 uh, oh I know what's going on. Yeah, do you see yourself now? Yes. <coughs> okay. So yeah, I am I am currently facing off against this small child. And yes. Uh And so here we go. I am now going to go ahead and my sword glows with a purple uh with, with a purple aura and I go this shall not hurt you. But it will also this shall not hurt the child, but it should drive you out, monster. And he proceeds to slash. <laughs> yes, me personally, I'm slashing. Anyway. Oh, okay. So Tim's slashing a child All right, with a psi sword. All right, let's see here. Boop, boop, boop. So 21 to hit. That does hit. Against will. So as you do that... You hear a sickening scream just coming out of the child's mouth as, um, where is it? Where, where did it go? I had, to, I had the pogs for this. All set up, ready to go, and it's not there right now. How dare it. Was it one of the, it was in this one? No. Was in the first one. It was not even back. No, she's not back yet, but her turn's gonna be a while. Oh. Unless we lightning round each turn. It's like, oh, I pass. Since <laughs> when do we lightning round these turns? Never! Ha ha ha! Oh, there it is. As this pops out from his uh out of his mouth Muteki kind of scowls under his helmet and proceeds to look up at it and states there you are monster <laughs> you shall not get away with this he's uh, uh, uh he just kind of twirls his blade a little bit it kind of leaves a little bit of a purple a uh, bit of a purple trail as he proceeds to state uh, as he proceeds to say, I could have said the same thing about you. Alright. Cultist's turn. Let's see. One, two is knocked down. Three, four, five is knocked down. So, ah, here we go. So this cultist fires, oh, no. fires a blast at you. Um, uh, cheese wheel. Yes, you forgot his name. Uh, alright, so my dodge is 15, so that's a 25 to hit. Yes, and that ball just goes whizzing past as he, he freaks out a little bit and steps to the side. He, he is the fear. Alright, Duran, you ready He's for this? He's a real hook. You're being attacked by one, two, three, four... No, wait. One, two... Three, four, five cultists. Two, three, four, five. Alright. So 19 to overcome your dodge, correct? 
do it. What is that right? It was 19 to overcome your dodge. Tim? Oh, yeah, uh, yes. Yeah, that's me. Sorry. No, not Tim. Dark. Attacking what? Dark. You so said the demon was attacking... No, no, the demon's well, not, turn's that not done. I'm saying oh, cultists. Oh, oh, the five oh, cultists oh, are attacking oh. Duran. My bad. My bad. I was too focused on the demon. I was like, oh, that's pretty cool. Uh, <laughs> okay, so let me boy. see. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Yes, it's a 9. You must be a 19. Okay. 19. Okay. My bad. First my bad. shot flies past your head. Okay, my bad, my bad, my bad. Second shot flies past your head. Okay, like, I'm just gonna say, is this one shooting at me? No. Uh, right now you got these oh, three that just fire, fire, oh, okay. fire. Okay, okay, okay. So I was gonna say, she sucks at shooting. Well, she's gonna stab you with a ceremonial knife. Ooh, fancy. And it's 19 to overcome your parry, right? Mm, yes. Alright, well, she stabs you. Give me a toughness check. Thirty. Very nice. All right. Bing. So it stabs into <coughs> you, but it's kind of like your muscle blocks any d actual damage. You're not bleeding or anything like that. Fuck yeah. Hey, by the way, so my regeneration. Uh, what's the snail represent again? That you're f uh, fatigued. Okay. So would my regeneration just get rid of my wound or get rid of my fatigue? Just your wound. Just my wound. Okay. Yeah. So it's co it's uh, coming up after this. Okay. Yeah, and finally, one more strike as a blast actually hits you. Give me a will save. A blast? Yeah, coming right from behind you. Down the hall. Oh, it's that little shit. Yeah, the one you just blatantly ignored. 27. Nice. That was almost a 20. That, that is very nice. All right. So, you feel the effects of... Something kind of whispering in your ear, but you shake it off. That's the cultists there. Duran, what do you do? You're being ganged up by five cultists. The system is a lot more forgiving when you split the party than other systems. Or soupy. Yeah, especially when you're dealing with a horde of minions. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to. I'm going to try to. I'm just going to try to like punch this lady in the face, and I'm going to try to twist her neck around. Twist it around, like you know, breaking it, like an owl. Yes. Owl? Yes. yes. Okay. I, I, I think that. he's just straight up snapping her neck. Basically. All right. Actually, yeah. Uh, remember the guy from Hunter x Hunter that basically just kept snapping all the guys' necks, just like Larry. That. You need to stop breaking people's necks. No. <laughs> Larry. <laughs> oh, demonic running, and yeah. Things stop blocking my die rolls. I want to see. Yes. You rolled a twelve, but, and you have total of nineteen. So. She hit. She now has to roll her toughness to see if she can actually resist your strength and overpowering arm strength so her neck doesn't snap. DC 29. Her neck snaps. She's down. <laughs> Excellent. And now I'm going to... Oof. And yeah... Okay. I'm gonna walk up and I'm gonna try to grab. <clears throat> Sorry, it's been forever. I forgot all my kids' names. Damn it! Give me a second. That's don't unique. tell me. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. Oh. Uh, la, 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 la. Uh, okay, I won't tell you. Not Randy. Yuki. I grab Yuki. All right. Well, you're gonna be. Try, try, well, yeah, try, here's try. the thing. Here's the thing. Are you going to try and fatigue yourself some more? 
Are you going to spend a hero point and get rid of your fi your current fatigue and then uh, get fatigue back for doing an extra action? Because you've already snapped a person's neck. Yeah, I was thinking about that. Like, I, I want to do that. Unfortunately, we're not in D&D &D where we get these things called extra attacks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <coughs> oh, yeah, my, my wounds are Unless, you have, to... <laughs> Unless uh, you have takedown. By the way, where am I on this turn order again? Yeah, where is she? Oh. I deleted you. Badness. Uh, you know, actually, I'm going to... Yeah, she's I'm not going to get, get, going to get uh, rid of the fatigue with my hero points. All so, right. boop, boop. And... Do you, do you just want me to roll, or...? No, I got you. I, I'm trying to remember where you were on it. I actually. think I had an 18, but I might be remembering that wrong. Yeah, yeah we'll just say it's 18. And I'm just going to, like, tell everyone Screws. around me... You'll be going next, by the way. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'm just going to tell everyone around me, if they... If they come after me, that they're going to end up like her. Or here, let me get... Let me get... <clears throat> Come after me, or any of my kids, and you'll all end up like her. Except I'm taking the entire head. And intimidation. But did he rip off a head? No, oh he my god, I'm neck. a puppy dog! Let's go! No, I no, you don't crit fail skills! Yeah, you don't crit fail skills, so let's okay, see if their okay. insight overcomes that. Like, I squeak during it. The, the, type, the top guy does is in fact intimidated. Okay. Uh, bottom guy is... The other bottom guy is... But the guy behind you is not. Oh, good, then I'll just snap his neck on the way. Okay, yes, and then I pass the turn to my... One of my, so the one of my favorite kids. Metis, yeah. Metis, it is That's my third turn. favorite yes. small. This... This small child is harassing Miyateki. How dare he? Well, he, he is demon has popped out now. Yeah, I, I, I knocked the demon right out of him. I'm gonna try and Still poke attached. the demon. Okay, try and poke the demon. Attempting multi-attack, go! I mean, I should probably swap myself over. <laughs> Niv jabs at some pressure points. <laughs> okay, Niv, let's see. A result of 17 against the little demon thing that has popped up. You missed, actually. It seems a little more agile while it's floating out of this kid's mouth than. By, by the way, has think. everyone seen Metis's new pog? Metis's new pog. Is... <laughs> oh, it looks adorable too. Oh, you kind of kept the same pose. It's adorable. <laughs> yes. Anything else you'd like to do, Metis? Her cheeks are more pinchable in that one, so I do approve of that. <laughs> um, I think I made mine too teeny. I'm gonna stick my tongue out at the demon. <laughs> Very nice. You stick the tongue out of the demon, and the demon just goes, Nah! <laughs> 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 Alright. Lobel's turn. Her eyes are actually glowing red as she has icy like claws for hands right now and she forms this ball of uh, snow in her hands and throws it right at you cheese wheel but it's not actually oh. at you it's in your direction it lands on the floor and the whole floor turns to ice oh boy I need you so, to roll me okay. a dodge check. <laughs> okay. Roll me dodge. Just to see if you can stand up right. Ease. With ease. You are just fine up there. And with that, this one goes up into the shadows. And the spooky shadows. <gasps> But it's right now this area. Let me grab my my f shapey tool to make iciness. 
up here. Right about there. That is currently covered in ice for floor. You make one step, you need to make fortitude to make sure you not prone. Not fortitude, but um, dodge to make sure you not prone. For the entirety that I'm in this area? Actually, it would end up being... Yeah. To stay up, you had to make sure that you, you dodge properly. If you move on okay. this, you're going to need to roll a athletics check to make sure you stay up. Okay. There you go. <laughs> Alright. So, this kid... And he sees you come close to him, and he goes, Stay away from me! And he fires off a <laughs> blinding flash of light right into your face. Duran and all the cultists, actually. Roll me a fortitude save. I'll be right real quick. Something just slammed in my... Uh... Okay. Oh, okay. That guy's fine. Dude, this dude is doing great. So what's your uh, fortitude, Duran? Dark? Hmm? Roll me your fortitude. You're getting a blinding flash of light from the kid you're trying oh, to Oh, I thought rescue. that was... I thought it was making it again. I'm looking at the dang screen, but I'm not paying attention. <laughs> Freaking, I was like, why is he... Why is he keep... Um, okay, fortitude? Fortitude. Fortitude. 23. Alright, you are... You actually um, end up getting a little bit dazed with that flash of light in your face. You are visually... No you, you are visually dazed. Well, you're just dazed, I guess. Yep. Little brat ends up uh, not being forgiving. So he... One, two, three, four, five, six. <clears throat> like, do I hear like him... Roll perception. Yeah, I want to say I hear him. Oh, wait, no, I have my freaking... I don't need eyes. <laughs> I have my freaking. That is that is Duran's new thing. He has the thing that lets him like defer souls, so he knows what Yuki looked like for his yes. soul anyway. So you do. You see two distinct souls run around you and go behind you. Did two? Yeah, two. Yeah, For, I forgot. Yeah, wait, no, I didn't. Jeez, I don't need my eyes. eyes. Your turn, cheese wheel. Hmm. Throw the macadamians. Cut the cheese. Oh, wait, that's a nut. All right. So, uh, fun thing. Um. So I'm I'm near the wall right now. Yes. Yes, you're right up against the wall. Okay. Uh, and and I'm surrounded by ice right now. On the floor, specifically. Yes. Uh. Okay. I'm just. So I'm going to start uh, ro wall crawling. Okay. <laughs> Just start clinging to the wall and get onto the ceiling. How high up is the ceiling? The ceiling's about 20 feet high. Okay, so now I'm upside down. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to go over to this dude and boop him really hard. Well, I have to drop down and boop him because it's like 20 feet. Yeah, you'd have to drop him and uh, drop on him or whatever. Yeah, I'm gonna drop on him. Uh, uh, I'm gonna. I'm and gonna you have him. safe. Well, yeah, you have safe fall, right? Or something to allow you just to land properly from 20 feet uh, high. I do not. Oh. All right. Roll me that there. Um... I believe it was you just roll a toughness check against the fall damage, right? Sure. This is gonna hurt. <laughs> I did take an injury already in my normal. 
Okay. I'm trying to remember fall damage. It's been... It's actually been a while since I did a Mutants of Mastermind session. Go figure. Good job. No, wait, we actually have this thing written up, don't we? Fall damage. Mm. Wait, so how much fall damage? I'm looking it up. Okay. Alright, so let's see. It can be used to... Ah! So you can use acrobatics to lessen fall damage. Okay. If you... Should I do that? Yeah, uh, do you want to do that? Ooh. Of course. Alright, yeah, no, you've lessened the fall damage j enough to to not really you've need to You've lessened the fall it. damage to zero. Yes. <laughs> I mean, it was only 20 feet, so... Get any higher, only be... 20 feet. Only 20 feet. Yeah, well, with an acrobatic skill like that, that's great. Alright, so you take no damage. So what, what else are you doing? You're doing an attack? Yeah, I did I do a roll that there. Alright, so 16 will hit. Um, and then they gotta overcome DC 23. As well as pain damage. Uh, pain affliction. They, they, they are unconscious. That would do it. <laughs> That probably really fucking hurt. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's all I can do for now. Alright, Nichols' turn. Oh, no. Alright, time to have some fun with this again. I need to open up my special doodad of a dice roller for him. Doodad. Doodad. Alright, let's see here. Oh, oh boy. Uh, 21 is... Oh, oh joy. And... Wow, okay, so... He ends up... T so Nickel, who's still technically being controlled, ends up touching himself and in a... Ha! Thank you. In a radiant glow of light, he seems to um, look very divine. He's giving off this very divine aura as the demon that's inside of him is now screaming in pain as it fades into mist. And he looks around going... What? what happened? He looks very confused. I'm letting you know right <laughs> now. I rolled insubstantial with a rank 6 insubstantial, which you can only go to rank 4, so he became incorporeal himself, but mm -hmm. with a descriptor of divine. So he essentially became a holy ghost. Okay. <laughs> that is, that he must is... be fun on, on, on Sundays. <laughs> so, with that, Nekul is free of the demon because the demon was overusing his powers, apparently. <laughs> the demon was like, I'm gonna use his powers to kill these people for extra iron- Wait, shit! <laughs> the vessel cannot handle it! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Muteki, what are you doing here? Muteki just kind of looks down at the kid and states, uh, uh, Muteki just kind of looks down at the kid and, uh, and kind of tilts his head a bit. He says, I should be asking that question of you. It is not good for small children to play in caves. We're treasure hunting. But where is it? Indeed, you are. Nice. You're here too? And who are these guys? He, he looks at the cultists. 
He is completely shocked and surprised. Miyateki. It's like, yep, so Miyateki just kind of glances down at him and states, uh, uh, kind of glances down over at him and, you know, not wanting to leave him here, he just states, follow, follow us at some distance, please. Uh, yeah, sure. And they were all... <laughs> I'm gonna take... I'm sorry. Um, That's fine. I'm decking Nekol off the turn order for now because he's no and they and they were out. and they went this way last we had checked right. Well, you saw Duran run off this way, and if I remember correctly, Cheese Wheel went that way. All right. So Duran went that way. Cheese Wheel went this way. Yes. Yes. So Muteki kind of calls over to Metis and states, Metis. I recommend yeah. that you go after Duran. Uh, all right. You are the only individual, other than uh, other than the small one here, who is capable of keeping him under control and keeping him from bringing the whole cave down on top of us. Yeah, right. he's a bit of a brute, but he's a softy. We love him. Indeed. Aww. And he just kind of and he just kind of moves off this way. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I've I've moved uh, three spaces already this way. So. Alright. Just, you know, dragging and dropping and all that good stuff. Child's trying to keep up. But granted, he's also kind of glowing, so let me just kind of give the glow. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and just take a couple steps this way, and well, there's shit happening here. <laughs> yeah. You are greeted by the were mouse once again. Miyateki kind of sighs deeply and states, Small one, please stand back. Ah, uh, okay, Mr. Miyateki. Cheese wheel appears to have turned into a... Uh, cheese wheel ap uh, appears to have... And if I may use the term that was uh, shown to you by your fellow children, hulked out. <laughs> 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 I, I am told that this is an expression. I'm not sure what it means. Me neither. I, I've never heard of it before. Okay. Nicole specifically yeah. has never heard of this before. Alright, so... <laughs> you know, I... Uh, so, I'm gonna just go ahead and spend the rest of my movement to... You know, step back a little bit, because I do not want to get eaten by Wear a Mouse. For some reason, my lighting isn't updating while I'm moving, but, you know. And that's about as far as I can go and as much can as I can do. Can you remember to give him sight? Yeah, I give him sight. Yeah, I have sight. It's just my roll 20 is not loading correctly. Oh. Well, All right, I'm just bringing this up over here. All right. Is that all you you do? Uh, Yeah, for the moment, anyway. Yep. Metis. Okay, I'm gonna jog vaguely this way-ish to try and find Duran. I'm gonna attempt that thing where it does an athletics to speed up a bit. Sure, roll me athletics. And fail. <laughs> yes, and fail, so you can still go 30 feet per movement. Yep, so I'm gonna go here. Okay. And not see anything, I guess. And then I'm gonna go over here. Alright. And, oh, that's a thing I'm staring at. <laughs> you see uh, evil-looking little Yuki and a, a cultist, and I'm guessing you see Duran. Do you see Duran? I see a wound right there. <laughs> yeah, that's, um... <laughs> that's... Yeah, yeah. I'm guessing they immediately notice my presence because of, you know, glowing hands. Uh, yes, they do. Uh, hello? <laughs> ah. Another friend of the demons. Demon. The one that's attacking uh. us. 
Oh Did yeah. Did you Do hurt I... him? <laughs> hurt who? The demon and and the kids and my friends. Why we would never think of hurting the children. They are our uh savior. Lord Conan the barbarian. <laughs> No, I was going to say the talk show. Yes. They are the um, prophesized ones. Hurting their minds is hurting them too. Prophesy. We have not hurt any of their mind. Haven't touched their mind. Then why was the last one possessed by a demon? Ah. So you know of the possession. There is no injury done to the children. Hurting their brains is hurting them too. She, I... She's trying to say psychological harm is harm as well, but she doesn't know what psychological is. <laughs> <laughs> Again, my dear child, there is no psychological trauma or d given to these children. Menace! Thank you! Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm here! Punch them! I'll try! <laughs> and I go here, and that's about as far as I can get. Okay. That That is literally all of my movement. <laughs> Unless you decide to, you know, fatigue yourself and do an action, you know? You know so what? I I'm gonna try and... Just to hear. spite them, pressure point this child. So that, like, not hurt, but yeah, yeah. makes their their demon hosts be have bad time. All right. You also got hero points to spend. Yeah. Well, yeah, fatiguing but... myself to multi attack. Awesome. I don't think that works, but you know. Uh. Snell. I mean, Neil. it has multi attack in there, so. Oh. Okay. So. The attack, while it does actually hit, every pressure point that you seem to hit on him feels like very solid, uh, like a very solid object rather than flesh that you're hitting. It's almost like he's wearing armor, and I can't get pressure points through that. Almost, almost like that. Yeah, it's actually very cold to the touch. It's like he has just, like, ice. like, pulls back her hands and shakes it out. Just like, ah! Yeah. Did Yuki make that noise? Yes. Okay, definitely gonna demon back. <laughs> Cultists turns. Alright, so... Oh, wait, no, they're all intimidated. Shit, they're gonna go after the small child. <laughs> Bastards! <laughs> So seeing that you are dazed, they find no reason to directly confront you currently. Fuck! As these three end up... Actually, all four of them fire blast. Well, those three fire blasts at you, Metis. Oh, boy. Uh, so 15 to hit, by the way. 15 to hit. Okay, so one hits. Two hits. Third one luckily misses. Um, I'm going to say the one in the back misses because they got three people to work through. So I need a will save times two. Okay, it should be noted that I do have half will resistance. Ooh. Fair enough. Fair enough. I'll make I don't sure know what that keep means, that in. but it sounds good. Basically, the amount of ranks to the damage that I'd be doing is halved plus ten. Anyway, there's one and there's two. Okay. What is wrong with my sheet? So mm -hmm. the first one for sure you have overcome. The second one, uh, you have ended up becoming. I believe it was entranced. 
There's one here. I think. This one with my. Sh uh, here we go. It was. So. Entranced. Yes, you are entranced. Weird question. Yes. I mean, I understand if you decide to not have it ha have it this way, but entranced gets broken the second I'm in danger. Correct. Would the third one attacking me, even if that did miss, be enough to break that entrance, or is it, or because it missed, or they all just fired at the same time or something, I'm still entranced? You're still entranced. Okay. I had a feeling that was the case, I just wanted to make sure. However, if the fourth person attacks you, that then you would be broken of the entrance. But mm -hmm. I had them already planned to attack Duran, since they were the only one not afraid. They actually walk up towards Duran and try and stab. And they actually stab. So. Yeah, Dodge and Parry oh, are both 19. Yeah. So uh, g give me a fort. Or not fort, but a uh, toughness. Tough. Uh, something's uh, just come up. Can someone take over a cheese wheel for me? Oh, okay. Uh, Why did sure. I roll two times? <laughs> what are you doing, Dodge? It's just six. Okay, so the sixteen tough. Yeah, because the set the higher one was the second roll, and it didn't mean twice. Okay. So Being you there. end up taking a wound. <gasps> oh, not really that intimidating or scary or whatever. All right, Duran, you just got stabbed, and you only have one action you can do this turn. Like, I feel all their, like, souls around me, right? All these mean guys. Uh, yeah. As Metis would call them, meaners. I mean, yeah. you can still make them out even without their soul. Yeah. But, but basically, since I got stabbed, I'm really bad. It's like... You're all fucking dead! And I smash my hands into the ground, and core explosion. A 30-foot radius, so... Yeah. I am in menace and everything. the effect was... That puts me in danger. <laughs> the effect was, um, fire and demonic? Demonic and fire, yes. Alright. Does this mean I'm no longer entranced? Yes, this means you're no longer entranced. <laughs> Okay, so roll me a dodge check. Alright, so... Demon cultist number one, fail. Two fail. Well, that one succeeded, so that's number three. And uh, time for the toughness. Oof, yeah, nope. Nah. -uh. I need to roll toughness, right? A dodge first, don't you? Oh, uh, right, um. Yeah, dodge first to see how much you do get. Okay, I'm fine. Yeah, you're fine. And it's time for Yuki. Alright, so. Managed to dodge, but this is his weakness anyway, so. Alright, so Yuki gets a wound and is dazed as a demon comes out of his mouth. Oh no, he has another access to another small? They're all different ones. I um, mean... So this I think he's saying that he has access to another small. Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Down, and... So all but one of them went down. In fact, this one doesn't even seem like they were even bothered by your attack. I can't believe that there's one elite mook. 
I want to fatigue myself to snap her, snap her neck, but I think I've done enough. All right. And I unintentionally saved Metis without knowing. It. Yeah, that is true. The only reason I did that is because they were all grouped up. All right. So. An icicle comes flying right at you, Miteki, and hits. Oh, God. Okay. I need you to roll me a t uh, fortitude. All right. <laughs> Was this like an area of effect thing then, or...? No, this is an icicle that just straight up struck you right in the leg. All right, and I uh, got through my dodge of nine. Two ice okay. people. Got through my dodge of nine. Okay, gotcha. All right, so I will now roll for the suit. <laughs> <coughs> my right. personal fortitude, apparently. Yep. <laughs> All right. So the ice seemed to spread a little bit on your leg, but. Um, it ends up breaking off, however you decide for it to break off. And apparently my dad's coming in with a strobe effect with the dog while I record. <sighs> yes, hi dad, how are you? You doing good? Why are you blasting people? That was like the rudest thing. What? <laughs> you call me? Did no. Me? I did not. No, okay. <laughs> anyway. So, yeah, shake <laughs> off an icicle. Congratulations. However you want to do Rule of Cool, Tim. All right, so... Muteki takes that icicle to the leg, shatters on his armor a little bit, and kind of like, uh... uh and, and just kind of like slides off a little bit on that end. Just kind of... Well. He's like, I'm not getting married yet. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> no cold feet. Oh, yep. I'm gonna go with that one, actually. <laughs> I am not getting married yet. Wait. Shit! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so... Now it's, uh, Metis' turn to be attacked by a demon. Oh! Okay. Um, this completely overcomes your parry. I rolled a nat 20. Of course. Of course. Oh boy. I need you to roll me a will save. Alright. Half effects again, but I don't think that's going to help me that much. Well, good news is that you would end up being um, dazed. Just kind of dazed as it's entering your mouth. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, now the demon really wants to die. So... Cheese wheel. Who's gonna take control? Uh, well, I, mean, not it. I think I think Tim should do it because I can't oh. actually see what's going on over there, and neither can Duran. Yes. Uh, here, let, let me let me actually just for for purposes oh. of here. Can you still not see Niv? There's just a swath of black. Swath of black. Um, I see it. It's more like dark gray. I got an idea. Huh? There you go. Ah! I'm um, duplicating you guys. Okay. There you go. So this small child is attacking, right? Uh, well, you can't really see that small child, but they're in the darkness. But yeah. Well, uh, che Cheese Wheel is his turn, though. Yeah. I mean, can Cheese Wheel see this small child? Yes. Okay. Uh, is ish. he 
Uh, let, let's have him do a skitter. Actually, what does fatigue do again? Fatigue just means that you um, half speed, go right? half speed. Gonna, how about we have him do a skitter over and try and grapply her? Alright. So, skitter, skitter, scatter. Let's get to the the gate. She's caricature. I hope everything's okay on his end. As he goes to do do the does the grapple. Hmm. Hmm. You're gonna have to roll that one for us. I know. I was just making sure that he didn't have a grapple default check. Alright, so as he walks half speed over there, he does the grapple thing to try and grab, which he succeeds in actually grabbing, so now there's the whole strength stuff. It was strength versus what was, what was... target then tries to resist with the better of strength and or dodge. The two results are compared, so you're trying to beat a sixteen, I think. No, I'm trying to beat the their strength. So that's a DC thirteen. Oh no, they're grappled. They are grappled. Okay, so we now have this small child restrained. Yes, and ready, they ready are, for Muteki to do whatever he wants. They are Excellent. screaming demonically. <laughs> all right, Muteki proceeds to uh, Muteki proceeds to dash upwards. Goes all like, uh, uh, and goes all like smite, and he is going to go ahead and slash. Ooh, yes, yeah, son. Yeah, that hits. Now time for a. Will save. And failed. So, that means that Demon Chan pops out. Uh, in a screech of terror. It's like, How dare you take us out? Yuteki just kind of glares at the demon and states... <coughs> Yuteki just kind of glares at the demon for just a moment and says, I have seen far worse. You don't even have a mask. What kind of demon are you? The kind of impe uh, foretelling your impending doom. Hmm, I heard that one too. <laughs> you can strike me down now, but my master will come. Mm. And Techie just kind of uh, uh, glares under his helmet and states, "Then I shall smite him too." Yep. <laughs> <laughs> More so, you have made a grave error. Oh. You have uh, uh you have uh, you it came after Duran's children. Oh. You'll find out. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Metis. You have a chance to resist. Oh boy. I will attempt to resist. Will? Will. And you forcibly... Get out of my head! Poof. He is now free from Yuki, who... Instead of it just kind of dissolving in a blinding light of divinity, he is out cold. Hey, Gate. Hello. Welcome What's happening there, since I left? You, you have grappled a small child. Yes. <laughs> I was like, I don't want to have you hurt it, so I'll just have you grapple it. Like, okay. I think we the last thing we need is child murder right now, so... Also, Metis, tr they tried to possess Metis, but she was just like, no! None of that! Shame <laughs> on you! Pretty much. And you can end anyway, up spending a hero point to get rid of your fatigue, and then 
just try to do another action by fatiguing yourself again. I mean, I'm just gonna get rid of the fatigue and then end my turn so that the daze goes away. Alright. Cultist's turn. There's only one awake left. They are going to spin up their their uh, leg and then jump onto this rock as they do a little hand sign and sink into said stone as they <laughs> go away. Oh, cool. If only I had to hear a point to intercept her and snap her. <laughs> Another day. She'll be like, you will be seeing us again. <laughs> All of you. I'll break your legs! And my master they don't will have be... legs! <laughs> my master will break yours instead. Duran. Okay. I saw, like, the entire, like, entire soul thing here. Like, this soul go uh, coming out of this one, but then this soul trying to go in this one, but then this one being like, no! And knocking it out, right? Yes. Good. I'm gonna run up to that freaking demon whilst on fire, being very scary. Okay. And I'm going to punch it in the freaking face. All that right. is the wrong roll. But, you know what? I'll keep that demonic double. Let's just say I hit him two times very hard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so no, I'm going for... Like, since I'm doing that, then I'm doing two hits to him. I'm doing a freaking uppercut and then a smash down. Alright, that's 28. And then I'm going to grab him. Well, here's the thing. You do... He's ethro. Well... Here's the thing. You do so much damage to him with your fiery fists of rage. Shadowy. Because this is demonic double. This one's shadowy. Ah, your shadowy fists of rage. Shadowy fists. How? Where, um... He ends up... Where is it? Where is it? Move that. There we go. Ends up going in a puff of smoke. There's not a real chance to grab him. <laughs> you have defeated him. Congratulations. Hooray. There's still and... one more. So, he's dead. And... All these cultists are... Wait, are all these cultists dead? Well... Was that completely... Were you trying to charbroil them to death? Or were you kind of going lukewarm? Just to knock them out. You know what? I didn't want to hurt Metis or Yuki, and I knew they were near me. So, but I knew they could take it. So I'm going to say lukewarm, because, okay. yeah, I didn't want to hurt the kids. All right, so they're not dead, but they are passed out. The other okay. two are dead, however, because you snapped one's neck. Yes. A ten. Let's see. Okay. I am gonna run past medicine. Yuki and tell all them. Medis, take care of Yuki. I'm gonna what? go look for everyone else. Uh, okay. <laughs> oh wait. Yeah. Uh, Things that happen stance. Can. Okay. I know I don't, like, I know I just use magic, but can I, like, uh, try to sense for the other kids' souls? Uh, you can give me one perception -y check for free. 19. Do All I right. see, do I feel anyone nearby me? And since I have accurate, do, do I know which one they are? Um, you are able to tell that, uh, how uh, what was both of their names here? You have natural da, 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 da. <coughs> aliens orphanage. Here we go. So you can tell that Paul and um, and Cat are down this way. Cat. That Lobel, that Cheese Wheel, Yuteki, um, some unfamiliar ones, and what looks like another demonic soul is over this way. Things Yuteki and Cheese Wheel can. 
Okay, yes. I passed my turn. Alright, so Lobel's turn once more. The demon fires basically some ice claws at the person grappling, which is Cheese Wheel. Missing completely because your wear rat form is very agile and capable yeah. of moving out of the way. So, Cheese Wheel, what you do? You have this girl with a demon coming out of their mouth um, grappled. Um... Okay, uh, run, run me through what happened. Yep. Um, well, so you grappled Lobe uh, Lobel, mm -hmm. um, and when you did, Muteki came over and slashed them with the Psy Sword, and a demon popped out of their mouth. There's a demon so in their mouth. The, okay, so there's a physical presence of a D-man in their mouth. Yes. Uh, it's actually floating above them. It's like coming out of their mouth. I, I'm going to slap that thing really hard. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. Slap that. No. <laughs> um, what are you slapping it with? Uh, this. Slap that butt. Probably incorporeal, and that's barely going to hit anything. Yeah. Um, so as you end up trying to slap it with your <laughs> bees result, uh, scratch. As you try to scratch it, your claw kind of just goes right through it. Well then. This is news. It is news. Though you still haven't grappled. As far as I understand. Unless, uh, actually, do you have that improved feet? What improved feet? No, improved feet. Grab. Actually, a... I think you can actually just attack normally. Um, with unarmed attacks while grappling. Yeah. Even without that uh, feet. It's just Our like, it uh, should be slightly difficult for me. Um... Right. So, okay. Well, Muteki. So, as as the claw passes through the demon, it's probably like cackling, going like, "You can't hurt me!" Oh God. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, well, and if you actually hit it. Muteki is gonna go ahead and slash through its freaking face. Okay. Slapper. Wow, nice. And it completely fails. It actually does this. As it disappears. We'll be back! <laughs> Amazing. It's, uh, Mutiki just kind of glances over at the were rat and states, What a strange creature. Oh. <laughs> 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 I think it's realization that he's right next to the freaking were rat. <laughs> War flashbacks. Alright, oh. combat is now officially over. You sure? I'm still next to the where rat. <laughs> if combat is over, Duran runs to where he th saw the other kids, or like he saw like the souls. Well, the where the rat, the where rat actually spent a hero point last time, if you remember, um, mm -hmm. to be able to have control of said form. Oh. Oh. I mean, I still, I'm still scared of it. You are. Oh. Do, do you want to attack it and continue a initiative order? He's like, PvP? Oh. he just kind of looks over at the were rat and's like, and notices that he isn't like lashing out immediately, right? So instead, Miteki's kind of going like, <laughs> <laughs> I find cats in Paul and I freaking grab them, both bear hugging. All right, you're standing yeah. on a thingy. Oh, yes. Uh, is this thingy bad? That this, thingy? Th that thingy is bad. Do I keep bonking against it? Like, bunk, 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 bunk. You do. There, there is actually some sort of force that keeps <coughs> demons out. 
and keeps the children in. Well, first I'm going to smash on the, the wall and be like, Cat, are you okay? Mr. Duran! Uh, by, Kat, by the way, Nace. Yeah? Can I see this? See that? Yeah, you see that. Okay. I'm going to, like, prop Yuki against the wall. Against real quick. This one? like, like Right where he is. She is. Like, Can lay, you just move me and take like, sit map? her upright and no. lay her against the wall for now? Okay, so she's leaning against Didn't this mean wall. To. And then I'm gonna try and scratch out this thing. Like, disrupt it. <laughs> okay. Uh, so, how are you attempting to do that? I pick up a rock and just, like, try and make a line through something that looks important. <laughs> well, as you make a line through anything, it wears away and the glowiness fades. I can't show that right now because it's actually part of the map. But I mean... The glowiness fades and the, it is just writing on a rock right now. Okay. I'm gonna keep punching this wall until it breaks. I go, I go back over to the small. Okay. I, I'm just babysitting, because right now I don't want to be alone in the dark. Mutiki, <laughs> Mutiki, picks up the, uh, Mutiki picks up the small, looks over at where we're at, and states, You are in control. <laughs> Alright, so... Nod for yes. <laughs> Nod for yes. I should mention uh, the... Uh, or I think it should work at that I, I've used the hero point to turn into it. Well, when and where I turn out of it is entirely up. Should be entirely up to the GM at this point. All right, you turn out of it then. Combat, I'm just picturing. I'm just picturing like uh, he's like nod for yes, and then where at like as he goes like this, uh, uh, like on, you just Pete, hear trees on. snapping. I got you covered here. Okay. I'm just laughing. I'm just laughing because that mental image is just great. <laughs> Not saying it actually happened, just saying it's funny. Hmm. Just Aku noises as he's... <laughs> yeah. So I, I, I poof back into uh, regular films like, uh, no, I don't have any control over it. I just really forced it. I see. Though, um, I'm going to say this. Your arm is kind of feeling a little twitchy right now. Some side effects from uh, forcing it. <laughs> it's um, like I cannot stop moving my hand. Can I smash this it. invisible wall? No. It is completely um, rep uh, basically repelling you. You know, like how in video games, and when uh, when they like want to yeah. make something look open and expansive, but in I, fact I, it's I an do. invisible wall. That's what we're dealing with right now. Well, then, well, no. angrily, I I do a perception check to see if I know where like <laughs> everyone's <laughs> soul. I'm trying to look for Cheese Wheel's soul. That's Perry. Ignore that. Okay. My bad. <laughs> uh, freaking! I tried to look for Cheese Wheel's soul. All and, right. Well, Cheese yeah. Wheel is behind you. In that direction. I'll I run over and get him. Where is he? Hi, Mutaki. <laughs> Hello, Menace. Uh, can you help me with carry is. this one? Ah! <laughs> I grab Cheese Wheel and Monette. Ah! So both the smalls. I grab them and then I run over back to where Cat is. <laughs> oh yeah, but if but... I need to make a gravel check, I will. By the way, she she is just kind of no, passed out as well because forcibly removing demon. Yeah. It's like now I'm just picturing I'm not now I'm just picturing Cheese Wheel like briefly forgets he's not where we're at for me. He's like no 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 <laughs> <laughs> So I carefully I carefully grab this like okay. I make sure to cradle her. Okay. And then I just grab Cheese Wheel by the collar and I'm start and I pull like I run oh. with him. <laughs> Plaguing in the wind. Okay. So still going no 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 <laughs> Basically. But in his head. Internal then, screaming. I'm like, if I remember correctly, cheese wheel. I hold cheese wheel over, like, towards the invisible wall, and it's like, Science! Now! <laughs> nah! <laughs> <laughs> what? Am, what? What's going on? Now! And then I throw him at it. 
<laughs> what oh, yeah, am I being thrown at? <laughs> well, there, there is a, a wall that um, Duran can't get through, but as... Hi, are, are you gonna Are you going to allow him to just throw you? Yeah. Yes, go ahead. This is funny. All right. So <laughs> I will he's... say I'm not like legit like chucking him like Bardock in, uh, in freaking Dragon Ball Fighters. I'm like tossing him. All right. So as you toss him at the wall, he goes <laughs> right through it. Ah! <laughs> what? I go through it then. Nope. <laughs> I keep punching it. <laughs> All right. You, you keep punching. Uh, aside from this like hollow punk punk sound you're not breaking through i'm just lying to the ground like right silence <laughs> <Sorry, laughs> now <laughs> oh hey mr cheese wheel hello how are you doing how are you doing uh how are you doing i'm kind of chained up at the moment yeah me too it, yeah it looks like Did you they are literally chain up the two small children yes because they figured <laughs> oh. out that they can't really affect them otherwise also, there's Jack. <laughs> mm. Okay. Uh, well, then. So I get up. Uh, let's see what I can do about this. Um, what do the chains look like? Are they like regular old chain with the weird clampy bit at the end of it? Yes. They are basically chained in shackles. I'm a slate of hands yet. All right. Roll slide of hand it. Be the bandit. Oh my god. I forgot. Oh, wait, no, that's where we're up. Okay, I, I, I picked up the wrong thing. That was a wear mouse form. Thank you. It's like, wait, I don't remember the slate of hand being that low. Everybody <laughs> knows what. Now, now, this is what everybody wants to see in the middle of their screens. Yes, of course. Yes, exactly. Yes. Aww. All right, so, cheese wheel. Mm hmm. As you go and finagle with cat's shackles, they they actually come out pretty easily. It was a very easy block to pick, apparently. Huh. For some of your skills and talents. Of course. <laughs> oh, well then. Thank G you! Uh, and, you're welcome. <laughs> and she hugs you. Aw, that's adorable. <laughs> it's like just an awkward pat on the head. It does feel... Yeah. It's like a bear hug, by the way. <laughs> Please, no. Need my ribs. <laughs> right. What about the other kid, Cheese Wheel? Are you gonna let, are you gonna let the other child suffer, Cheese Wheel? <laughs> oh, they look fine. They, they look like they're having fun. <laughs> Paul is just like, aww. Uh, I'm intimidating Cheese Wheel through the, the, through the invisible wall. <laughs> Why? Well, that, that's that's just player interaction. So you know, Work I'm just picturing faster. <laughs> I'm just picturing. I'm just picturing like his 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 like uh, you know open mouth face just kind of smushes up against the glass uh, up against the like invisible thing like glass. You see like little fog there. <laughs> the open mask, yes. Open mask. He's like, Ugh! like a goddamn like. Like you know the, the 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 chubby kid looking at the chocolate shop that you see in like every bad Christmas film. All right. <laughs> sure. Okay, right. give me a minute, Duran. Jesus. Science faster. Science. 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 This is like locksmithing at best, which I suppose under some circum circumstance could be considered a science and like engineering, I guess. Anyway, I'm gonna go Why? do that then. <laughs> <laughs> I roll your it's sleight like, of hand. Distant sounds of like Piccolo going, Bite the chains! <laughs> this this <laughs> seems to be a lot harder to to remove compared to, to cats. Well, I'm just, it's I'm like, just picturing you. They know who the real threat is. They, they oh know who the real threat is. <laughs> Paul, Paul is just like, Yeah, they kind of. Um, Double double chain not a, I broke not a the disc. first one, so they got me three. <laughs> so they got me three. <laughs> ah. Yeah, that. <laughs> okay. Um what what's the chains the chains attached to? Are they just like nailed into the rock behind him? Yes. Okay. I'm going to shoot the rock behind him. You're with gonna that... shoot the rock behind him, okay? With what? Oh god, Cheese with Wheel's using his guns again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
I'm using the I don't I'm using the I don't know if these even work guns. Okay, because you still had what one of them left? Yeah, the battery pistol. I, I don't want to use the floaty that... boy because that's going to kill both of us probably. Well, I can't remember, believe cheese wheel is. It's only one use per um, invention, unless you're spending a hero point. I have no hero point. By the way, as soon as the cat, as yeah. soon as the kids come out, I pick up all of them. All right, cat is picked up, and she is now riding on your shoulders because she yes. climbed so, fully there. So this should be my re- <coughs> re- remain my remaining shooty capu. All right. Eh. Please do not crit fail. Well, you are very lucky that that was a four and not a one. Accidentally shoot small child in front of demon who's protecting them. That would be, uh... At least you'd have a barrier to protect you. (laughs) I'm just gonna be staying here for now. (laughs) It's like, it's like, and the rest of us are gonna die because the cave collapses. But, you know, (laughs) he brings the fucking mountain down on top of us. It's a toughness of the Little hook on the wall. And toughness of the rock. Alright, so the chain itself that's in the rock, nothing mm-hmm. happens to it. However, the rock surrounding it essentially disintegrates. Huh. <laughs> I mean, okay. that's one way to free a small <laughs> child. <laughs> Yeah. Huh. D batteries actually have a use. <laughs> my goodness. <laughs> I, I kneel down and have my like free arm open for Paul to jump into. All right. God, I pa- Paul <laughs> Paul just kind of walks over and then uses the chains to wrap around your neck to pull himself up. Excellent. <laughs> I do not mind this. And then I start heading to where I left Yuki. Alright. Muteki's going off. Muteki's just sort of glancing down at Yuki and going on like, so. The demon got out of him and it tried to jump into me, and so I shoved it out, and then now he's now he's asleep. She's asleep. He. I see. Uh, I'm going to grab Muteki and push him to the side. <laughs> uh, I... Should I take should I take knockback damage? That getting. <laughs> oh, no, no. Can and I? I pick, and then I pick up Yuki. Bits and- what, what embeds you... in the goddamn wall. Hold on. Jeez, Bill, what you gonna do? Can I, uh, copy the, the, the weird symbols written on the ground? <laughs> <laughs> I might need them later. <laughs> <laughs> it is gonna take you some time, unless you have a camera. Camera phone? He has yeah, a smartphone! Yeah. Alright. Wait, so he... doesn't, doesn't Metas yeah, have the phone? Got... Oh, Cheese Wheel has one, too. That's how they communicate. Oh, yeah. It's not like only one person in this party can have a phone. I this, thought, this is, I thought um, that's how it was, actually. Th- this is Dungeons & Dragons, where future <laughs> technology is a very rarity, and so there's this one telecommunication device that allows you to talk to the future. I thought but Metis was one. the only one that got one, and I forgot what <laughs> Metis got it in the first place. Hmm. I need to give Mutechi a phone just because it'd be funny. funny. Yeah, no. So yeah, I'll, 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 I'll take a picture of the symbols on the ground for research later. <laughs> All right. But yeah, I pick up Yuki with my other arm, and then <clears throat> I turn around and, like, basically have my back to Metis if she wants to hop on. So I have no trouble getting out, right? No, you have no issue at all. It, it's a, okay. it is quite literally a demon prevention wall. I, I can walk, thanks. Let's, okay. let's just go home. I'm going to start looting the unconscious cultist. <laughs> I make sure to. Uh, I'm just going to walk oh. out. Miteki's going to. Miteki is going to walk out as well. Yep. A- as you go to loot them, you find mm-hmm. some books. You find mm-hmm. some, um, some some wands, and you find some a pouch full of random assortment of objects. So just like, oh, okay. <laughs> and and also, as you were searching, you ended up finding out that they're not wearing anything under those robes. That is a man's dick. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and a Verjurner. Yeah. So I'm, I'm just walking out with all the kids, <laughs> carrying them. Not them at all. Well, you don't, okay, you don't so actually have to go and do that. Well, the thing is, if I'm going to do something... Wait. 
like I'm going to say walking out, if I notice that any cultists still have a soul in them, I'm going to step on their necks and crush them. Oh. Of course, looking like I'm not intentionally doing it. Alright. Whoops, I accidentally... Over. Let's go Jesus. back to here. Whoops, crunch. Yes. Okay. Oh. Oh, God. Roll, roll your... So he's so essentially Dar uh, Duran's going around. Duran's going around. And he's going to like, oops, I'm just doing. <laughs> so oh, I shouldn't have yelled. I'm sorry. You crush this You're guy's fine? head. Or oh, neck. I'm over the neck. The neck. You crush this guy's neck. This guy, on the other hand, you think you've crushed it, and you end up seeing Nicole just kind of. Waiting, looking around. Yeah. He's still glowing with holy divinity light. Yeah. I Is pick it, him up too. Like, you, I find some way to put him on. Your hand goes right through him, and it actually hurts you when you try to grab him. You get a wound. One I'll that won't. One that won't heal for with your regeneration. Okay. <laughs> time. So I'll just keep the one I have since the other one will probably. Re yes. So. Oh, hi, Mr. Graham. <clears throat> hey. Are you okay? Yeah, I, I'm fine. Though I can't really seem to touch anything other than the ground. But there was this weird puff of smoke, and then I saw Mr. Mr. Mutaki and, and Metis. And, I, and then all those um, knocked out people. I, I don't understand what's going on. Also, I'm glowy. Well, let's go home. He Good is thing. glowy right now. He hugs you. It hurts. I endure it. <laughs> <laughs> then, yeah, I'm going to step on this guy's neck, too, while walking away. Oh, oh God, you what the you, fuck? You thought you already um, got that one. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Then, yeah, I'm just carrying all the kids and letting Nicole walk beside me. All right. And then we can do that. Then we go to that. I am going to say this. Even though Duran thinks he got the neck, after you guys leave, he sits back up, rubbing his neck as if nothing happened. As if it, he, it, he feels this small pain in it. I rolled a natural 20 for his toughness on that one. Noise. <laughs> it's we're, we're it's like evil villain. villain. Here we go. In, <laughs> in Vince A. Bell goes all like, man, joining a cult was the worst idea I ever had. <laughs> that was, that's, that's his yep. power, an iron neck. I, I, I'm just going to go home now. Where's the water? <laughs> hang, on, where's the, the hang on, where's my, where's my, where's my, where's the truck? Where's the this truck? is not my home. wonderful house. This is not my wonderful octopus wife. <laughs> this is not my <laughs> wonderful octopus babies. Oh Jesus! Oh yeah, that was a thing. Yeah, it was. He had By like the way, thousands Mace, of We children. need you to upsize the new pogs. <laughs> but they so adorable. <laughs> is that tiny little oh, uh, tiny know. little <laughs> bite-sized <laughs> menace fits, fits in fits in Duran's j pocket. pocket. Yes, exactly. <laughs> That's about right. Is she supposed to be about the size of uh, Cheese Wheel? How uh, tall is Cheese Wheel? You know what? I, I think Cheese Wheel's actually smaller than Metis. He's about, Metis is five foot two, so... Um, Cheese Wheel is five. Wow. Oh, okay. so then... So this oh, so is my accurate. height for Metis wasn't off. Muteki oh. is five foot nine. Let me grab Muteki, please. Cheese Wheel's wear, uh, wear rep form is four <laughs> feet. Amazing. He actually gets smaller. He doesn't hulk out. He kind of shrinks. Thrawn is a 6'5", <laughs> so... He is the, big. Look at these actual fucking... Dorks. This actual accurate height comparison, and then just the fireball <laughs> behind her head. It is actual size. Muteki, Muteki's just gonna, uh... I just, I, I kind of want to RP out Miteki getting his first phone, too. Oh my I mean, god. Shit, we can, you can do that on, on we can do that on, uh, the, on your oh. own time. Yes. 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 And I will need to update the, the sessions. 
Well, thank you guys for for joining us here. Um, that, Might that's... get sell to make a cheese wheel bug. <laughs> well, that's the end of. Uh... <clears throat> We're done now. See you next time. So long. Staring Bye. intently at Gates. Bye. Bye. What's going on? I'm gonna go sleep. He wants now. you to make. Ask him to make the pod. That he already made one. Did you? It's actually in the progress. Oh, okay. Cool.